Hi folks, this is Apple Geek. Next up on Binge Reaction Saturday is Dinky Shark Fighter 32. Um, apparently a bunch of videos of Dinky from the Rainbow Dash Present series trying to become a YouTube star. Um, yeah, that might be an interesting watch. Probably is better than anything I'm doing. <laughs> well, let's just go ahead and get started. Uh, three videos, first one starting now. Got an intro which I don't have yet. Wow, that's awesome! <laughs> oh hey hi, guys, Dinky Shark Fighter Thirty Two here, and welcome to my first video on my new YouTube channel, Dinky Shark Fighter Thirty Two. I'll be making lots of videos for you all because I have lots of important and interesting things to say and share with the world. I have lots of life experience, you know. I'm wise beyond my years. <coughs> in addition to sharing with you stories from my interesting life and like moments... the Philly Fantasia post in the background. I am so <laughs> random! I'll be doing some let's watches and unboxings. So be sure to hit the subscribe button. <laughs> if you like this video, be sure you hit like and favorite this video. Oh, and leave positive comments down below, and share this video on Twitter and Facebook and MySpace. MySpace? MySpace goes with... Bye, everybody! <laughs> I think technically it does, but it's worthless. Oh, that... That was it? <laughs> okay, wow, well, that one was short. Um, yeah, alright, I guess all these are pretty short. Um, yeah, that was an epic introduction sequence um <laughs> that was half the video oh man one of these days i really need to try and put together some sort of an intro thing i don't know hopefully think of something anyway moving on nightmare night that's starting now lots of cats in this i love it <laughs> Some of these best artwork I've ever seen. Haha, ha. I scared you. So before I get into this, I just want to thank you all for watching my first video. I got just over 200 views and 18 new subscribers. So thank you all so much. It means a whole lot. Now, as I'm sure many of you are aware, it's a super important day today. What day is that? Well, it's Nightmare Night! Nightmare Night, what a fright! Give us something good to bite! If you don't, you'll be scared! For our pranking, you're unprepared! So, I just got back from <laughs> trick-or-treating. This year, I dressed as a spooky Halloween cat! Much better than my Fire Mirror costume from last time. Look at all this candy I got! Fire I got okay. a popcorn ball, some candy corn, very nice, a track, Okay. Ooh, a gummy eyeball. I love these. Gummy eyeball. Please have juice inside, please. Please. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, man. That was really good. <laughs> Talk about eye candy. But I'm sorry. That was a dumb joke. It was beneath me. Yeah. Thanks for watching my super scary video, everybody. If you like this video, be sure you like and favorite it and leave spooky comments down below. You can subscribe for more videos and be sure to share this video on Twitter, Facebook, and Google Plus. Hi everybody. Hi. Yes, Google Plus. <laughs> Directed by, written by, <laughs> Staring instead of starring, yes. Okay. Okay, um, <laughs> I don't even know what to say about this. These are awesome. Oh, man.
Yeah, I don't think my videos are quite the same as Dinky's. <laughs> Although I don't know if I'd categorize them as worse or better. <laughs> that's that's honestly up to you, you your guys' opinion. So anyway, um <laughs> I'm not connecting the this spooky Halloween cat or whatever. Those are like really long claws for a cat. So, and I was thinking more Wolverine claw wannabe things, but they don't probably know who Wolverine is. So I, whatever. Then again, their Nightmare Night costumes have uh, been representative of things from the human world anyway. So why not? Uh, yeah, the gummy eyeball that. Is that, is that a thing? Are there, like, gummy eyeballs that you can buy out there for, like, Halloween candy? I Interesting idea, but, yeah, whatever. Uh, I'm just going to move on to the last one here. <clears throat> New camera. All right. Starting now. Hey, guys, I'm back, and I have a new camera. Ha, now I can vlog from anywhere. No longer shall Dinky be confined. Sorry, it's been there so long no since I've video. I've been really busy because my grandmother came over for a week. She <laughs> the hardest she on the stuff. shelf. Whenever she's over, she always bakes her famous blueberry muffins, which are delicious. Actually, they're purple for some reason. I'm not sure if I get that. I guess I guess they're cupcakes. Yeah, I guess they're cupcakes. Bubbles anyway, reference. She also buys me really cool stuff. For example, she bought me this camera. <laughs> This year I told her I was working on a video series on YouTube, and she was so proud of me that she insisted on buying me this camera. Ah, oh, she's so great. Check it out, check it out. Black and white. Sepia tone. Night vision! My mom doesn't seem to think so, though. She always gets on to Grandma for spoiling me and always seems to have a bone to pick with her, but I'm not really sure why. Grandma is always so supportive of me and what I do. Aww. Well, I mean... I guess she's a tad forceful when it comes to my magic studies. I mean, she's, she tells me to study hard all the time and that I need to get my grades up. And, you know, I know, I try, I try really hard, but I just have a hard time with it, you know? It, it's a genetic thing. No, really, I heard my mom talking with Grandma about it last week. You see, non-purebred unicorns have a harder time picking up on magic than others. It's a completely natural mm -hmm. disability, and my teachers don't seem to get that. They're supposed to show special consideration, but they don't. That's why I'm getting the low grades, I'm sorry, this video's wow. gotten really off track. I forgot what I was making this about. <laughs> oh, New yeah. camera! Look, it snowed last night. I'm gonna go make a snowmare. Awesome! <laughs> Aww. <laughs> wow. Okay. Um, yeah, some more actual continuity in this one. Um, Derpy's mom, Dinky's grandma, and the the purple muffin slash cupcake things. Interesting. Um, yeah, interesting a little bit though about the the whole you know non non purebred unicorn having harder time with magical studies. I mean that makes perfect sense. You know, that, that kind of thing is never really, well, my mind just went to, to, um, pumpkin cake though, who is clearly not purebred unicorn, <laughs> either is pound cake for purebred Pegasus. They've got two earth pony parents and those two are ridiculously overpowered. So... <laughs> But it still could be a thing. I mean, it just, you know, genetics, you know, special talents, crazy things can happen, you know. So I, I say it's totally believable that a non purebred unicorn might not be able to pick up on magic as easily as others that are purebred, you know, I, whatever. Um, I mean, even for that matter, even purebred unicorns, probably some of them don't pick up that easy. Look at Sweetie Belle. She's had a hard time getting, you know, getting the hang of her magic, so. Anyway, um, no, these were fun. Uh, they, these are really fun videos. <laughs> um, I, I just, uh, I gotta stop saying um so much. Uh.
I wish we could see more of these, but I, I did note that all of these were uploaded back in like 2013, and I haven't seen any since. Uh, I know they were done by Pedirap himself, not Greg. And knowing that Pedirap got completely burned out on all the RDP stuff, yeah, I figure it's probably unlikely we're going to see more of these. Which again is sad, but you know, you got to do what you got to do. If you know, if if your hobbies are taking too much of your time and energy and everything, and you know, you got to back off sometimes. So. Anyway, fun stuff. Uh, thanks for the suggestion. And moving on to other things. I've got some content coming up here that has nothing to do with Greg or Pedirep. So it'll be interesting change of pace here. Uh, catch you again, hopefully, in a little while.